Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today in this fully animated lecture, you will learn about proteins. Proteins are essential macronutrients that are made up of amino acids. Proteins are present in all living organisms. They make up the bulk of the non-bony structure of the animal bodies and are major component of all living cells. About 50% of the dry weight of cells is made up of proteins, protein also found in muscles, hair and wool. Now let me teach you, what are amino acids? When thousands of amino acids combine, they form a protein. So what are amino acids? The structure of an amino acid consists of a central carbon atom, also known as the alpha carbon, which is bonded to four different groups. These four groups include an amino group, a carboxyl group, a hydrogen atom, and a side chain represented by R. The side chain makes each amino acid unique and determines its specific properties. So amino acids can be defined as organic compounds consisting of both amino and carboxyl groups. There are 20 different types of amino acids. But our bodies can only produce 10 out of the 20 amino acids. These 10 amino acids are called non-essential amino acids because our bodies can make them on their own. However, the other 10 amino acids cannot be synthesized by our bodies and are called essential amino acids. This means that we must get them through our diet. Animal-based foods such as meat, fish, eggs, and dairy products are complete sources of protein, which means they contain all the essential amino acids. Do you know my dear students, how amino acids combine to form protein? When two amino acids come together, the amino group of one amino acid reacts with carboxyl group of the other amino acid, resulting in the elimination of a water molecule. And the bond formed between these two amino acids is known as peptide bond. This process continues as more and more amino acids are added to the chain, ultimately creating a protein with a unique sequence of amino acids. Proteins are also known as polypeptides. Well, it's because proteins are made up of many polypeptide chains. These chains fold and twist into complex, three-dimensional structures, giving each protein its unique shape and function. Proteins can be classified into four types, primary, secondary, tertiary, and quaternary proteins. Let's start with primary proteins. These are the simplest form of proteins and are made up of a linear chain of amino acids. The sequence of amino acids determines the protein's function and shape. Next, we have secondary proteins. These proteins have a more complex structure and are formed by folding of the primary protein chain. Moving on to tertiary proteins, these are even more complex than secondary proteins and have a 3D structure. They are formed by folding of secondary protein structures. Finally, we have quaternary proteins. These are made up of multiple tertiary protein structures that come together to form a larger protein complex. Now we are going to talk about function of proteins in our body. One of the main functions of proteins is to provide structure to our body. Collagen is a protein found in our skin, bones, muscles, tendons, and even our organs. It gives our skin its elasticity and helps our joints to move smoothly. Proteins are also responsible for the transport of molecules throughout our body. Hemoglobin is a type of protein found in red blood cells that are responsible for transporting oxygen from our lungs to the rest of our body. Antibodies are also proteins that are produced by our immune cells. When a virus or bacteria enters our body, our immune cells produce antibodies that specifically target and neutralize the harmful pathogens. Enzymes are another type of protein that is involved in catalyzing chemical reactions in our body. One example of an enzyme is amylase, found in saliva. It breaks down starch molecules into smaller glucose and maltose molecule. This means that, if we don't produce enough saliva, we may have difficulty in digesting carbohydrates properly. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please, consider subscribing to our channel for more content like this.